So with <coughs> the haggis, we have turnip, potato twill, whiskey and green pepper corn juice. So the haggis we're going to roll in a, like a phyllo pastry foil de brie. The turnip we are going we have puree turnip and we also have spaghetti turnip. On the potato we have a crisp twill which we do the potato like matchsticks. Season it with a little bit of butter, salt, and we cook it in between two trays. Okay. Okay. So, potato, some salt, and a little bit of melted butter. Seasoned enough, and then we just take spaghetti. Make a nice round. Okay. Quite rustic. Okay. Take the grease proof on top. Another tray on top. Just press it lightly. And then we put that in the oven. Okay, so haggis. Okay. So normally we'd let it sit out for a wee bit just to soften it up. So, make it into like a round. So basically we're making a posh, posh spring roll. So, we'll have a little bit of flour and water. Got an option. So we just make a paste with the flour and water. Again, just lightly. So, Nice and tight, we need the pastry to be nice and tight. Just fold it in. So we're keeping the haggis inside the okay. Just make sure it's sealed. A little bit more on the inside of the pastry. means when I'm rolling it, it's nice and tight. Okay, it's all sealed in. Turnip is done the same way as what we did the potato. Put the machine, nice and fine. Spaghetti, and then turnip puree. With the trimmings that we have from that, we just sweat that down. Okay, so just take the excess butter off here. Just trim up the edges. Cut it an angle. You've got a haggis supper. Okay. Finish with your potato crisp. Okay. And that's it.